The first fruit farm I sold was in 1983, and I've been at it ever since. It's all about people, and all about horses, and all about land. You could be looking for a 300-acre stud farm for a client, or looking to sell one, or you could be looking to sell a 50-acre stud farm. We had a particularly successful 17, with a landmark sale of Bally McCall Stud, which had wonderful history of breeding, successful uh, derby winners and group one winners, 293 acres, and we sold it in a highly charged auction in the Shelburne Hotel for 8,150,000. Others we sold as well, Locktown Stud, uh, which again is about six or eight miles from Manouth. It uh, was sold privately after the auction for over 3.2 million. And the last one was up near Enniskerry, Bally Seskin, nice house, 125 acres, and it made 2.5 million out of the auction. The main areas where stud farms are sold are Kildare and the surrounding counties. And of course, the other very important area is Tipperary area, which is near Coolmore. The number of stud farms sold yearly would be in the order of four to eight. There are a small number of estate agents who specialize in stud farm sales, and we, of course, are one of the leading ones. The primary assets that potential buyers would look at would be number one, the quality of the land, number two, the location, the buildings, whether there's a residence or not, whether the stud has a history of breeding successful winners. We have buyers at the moment to buy stud farms up to 10, 15 million. Prospects for 18 are good. I expect we will have probably again about between three and five stud farms uh, on the market this summer. Uh, we have one confirmed already. Grange Con Stud, uh, which is near Kilcullen, on about 250 acres, with a superb residence, uh, one of the best stud farms in Ireland. I believe there'll be a very good market this year for good quality stud farms. Mm -hmm.